Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Do not watch this video if you are not looking to grow your hair. Are you dealing with premature grain, hair loss or any form of scalp irritation? Then this video is for you. Stay with me guys as I walk you through the entire process. You don't want to miss out. Hallelujah. 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 Take it from the top, they be like, oh my god, I can't believe Jasmine, when infused in oil, is a natural moisturizer for your hair and protects it from damage. It also hydrates and protects your hair and scalp. Next, we're going to be adding some rose petals. Rose petals are high in vitamin A, B3, vitamin C, and E, which help to nourish your scalp and stimulate hair growth. Then we're going to add some brahmi powder and some amla powder. Brahmi powder prevents premature grain. It acts as a natural conditioner. It thickens your hair and promotes hair growth. Amla, on the other hand, reduces hair fall and prevents hair loss. It treats itchy scalp or irritated scalp, and it also helps to strengthen your hair follicles. We also added some fenugreek powder. And next, we're going to add some cloves and Finally, we are going to add some oil to this. I'm using extra virgin olive oil here. I like to add fenugreek and cloves to my hair recipe or hair formula rather because of the wonderful benefits that it gives to the hair. The um, ingredients that I've used for this oil are, are really healthy and I picked them out because they're, they're actually interwoven. So we're getting a lot of benefits or similar benefits from all the ingredients we're applying. Okay. So this is about a 400 ml jar, but I realized later on in the video that, come on, I needed more of this oil than I had already added. So just tear this up really well and make sure that all the ingredients are absorbed by the oil. And after this, you're going to top up with some more oil to completely cover the to completely cover the mixture, and then you let it sit. I actually let this oil sit for about six weeks before I, you know, decanted it out or sieved it out rather. So in between, what I did was just to stay it every week and then let it sit again so i stirred it once every week as you can see the jasmine the rosemary are up at the top i also added rosemary much later on in the video and two other more ingredients into this jar so now i have more of the oil you can see how all the ingredients settled down this is six weeks later and it has properly infused guys I am really happy with this because the fragrance of the oil, it didn't give that kitchen smell. It also didn't give that um, strong herbal smell. Yeah, because I noticed a lot of people complained about the strong herbal smell. But also note that the source of your raw material counts. So you might just be getting the raw material from the wrong place. But trust me, guys, if you get the right brahmi powder and the right amla powder and you put all these things together, you will realize that your oil is really great. The fragrance is great and it's just natural. So I just turned everything into a sieve. Look for what works for you. But I will advise that you use... um. A cloth like this because it will help you know give you better results as you can see here the oil is so dark it is really dark and i am so happy with the results because it infused really well so i'm also going to dilute this down with some more oil so i'll be adding some more extra virgin olive oil and then i will also add my other 
additions my essential oils and the other oils that i want to add to that no time i'm gonna rest back and i make that money they'll be back before that prep time how would you feel if i told you i'm all grown now no i ain't no touch that that was me before the touchdown now we in a rover now we take it from the top we go hallelujah hallelujah Next, I'm going to add some castor oil. Castor oil helps to increase hair volume. It helps to strengthen your hair strands and hair follicles and also improves hair growth. I have just added about um, 100 ml of this into the oil and what is left of in the other jar, that is the other beaker, I'm going to add it to it. So, um, I will also like you guys to know that uh, when you're done sieving, right? When you're done sieving, just make sure that you let the oil sit. We're going to add some peppermint oil. I tried not to do too much of the essential oils here. So I did just peppermint oil and um, cedar wood. Yeah, so it gave it a woody, a woody minty fragrance and it was just really cool guys i love this i love it i love it i love it and finally you know of course i am definitely going to add this which is my vitamin e oil this will help to extend the shelf life of the oil it will also keep it from oxidizing and that's about it so that is the final addition for this after this instead of decanting it into my storage um bottle like i do or decanting it for sale what i do is to let it sit so after this i'm going to let this oil sit for about one week or two weeks that is because i want everything to settle so i'm going to have all the powders the amla and the brahmi powder settle but if you have other separation methods that can actually help you achieve this within a shorter period of time you can actually do it but in my hand here i have a one liter bottle and i'm just going to turn everything inside and let it sit for about a week so guys moving forward i'm going to show you guys the um the herbs that I actually put together, there are about three other ingredients that I added that I did not mention in the video. So I'll show it to you guys. And if you can guess what the other additions are, you stand to win a free bottle of 100 ml oil. If you can guess even two out of the three, you stand a chance to win a free bottle of 100 ml oil but you're going to pay for the delivery but the oil is going to be free yeah so this is uh these are the herbs that i put together guys so this is one week later and i have everything settled at the bottom what i'm going to do now is just to decant into the speaker and after this, I will transfer it into my storage bottle for use. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in my next video, okay? You know, I really thought that I was filming at some point. I didn't know that the video had stopped at some point. But thank God I was already done with the preparation and all. So once you just transfer into your storage jar, just make sure you keep it away from direct sunlight and you can use it for daily application for braids. You can add it to your spray bottle. And guys, I must say that the effect of this oil is amazing. I hope you guys give it a try. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.